Yo, what's up guys? It's your boy Olushla David and you welcome to my YouTube channel. Now in today's video, I'm going to be walking you through a step-by-step -step guide on how you can create your own personal TransferWise account. Now the good thing about this TransferWise account is you can have several bank accounts under the same account. Okay, you can have an account in US, you can have an account in Britain, you can have an account in whichever country you want to and you can control and manage all of them inside one account okay but you should have at the back of your mind that creating a transfer wise account is in two ways okay you can either have the personal account or the business account so it is easy to get started with a personal account because you, they don't actually require any paperwork to get started using the personal account but if you want to use the business account then your business should be registered and you should have your document ready to be uploaded because they are going to review your business before they activate the business account for you so once you have the business account you can as well receive money from any part of the world and equally send money to any part of the world but with a personal account you can receive money and you can send money but your account is going to be limited to some certain countries okay the number of accounts you can have with a personal account is limited compared to the number of accounts you can have with the business account okay so that's basically how it works so without any further ado i'm going to proceed and show you how you can create your create an account on transferwise okay so let's get started so as you can see i'm on the I'm on the home page for TransferWise and I'm going to click the register button to get started. Okay guys, so as you can see, we have the personal account and we have the business account. Okay, so what we have to do, just leave it at the personal account and what you have to do now is enter the email address you want to use. So in this case, I'll just put my email address quickly here. Okay, so my password. All right, so then you have to choose your country of residence. So in my case, I'll simply put Nigeria. All right. All right, so as you can see, my account is created and I'm inside my dashboard. It says welcome to TransferWise, send money, get paid, and spend abroad up to eight times cheaper than with a bank. Okay, so as you can see, we have send money here, receive money here, get a card. So and this is one, one of the benefits of using a TransferWise account. You can equally have a credit or debit card of your own. Okay, and you can easily walk up to any ATM and cash out your money depending on the currency you are using. Okay, so so it depends on what you want to use your transfer wise account to do okay so we have send money we have received money so if you want to send money or if you want to use it to receive money just click on the receive money all right so like i said earlier i said it's in two ways which is the personal use and the business use okay so now this is for a personal user account and this is for a business account so everything is incorporated together inside one account okay so even if you are starting with a personal account that doesn't mean you can still not have the business account so whenever you are ready to use the business account you can simply click on the business account but now if you don't have your document ready i'll suggest you start with a personal account so i'm going to start with a personal account here so i've clicked on the personal account so it's going to ask you to create your own personal profile okay so what i have to do here is enter my full name so the next thing to do now is to click the save button okay so as you can see step two d2 this is why i said you should use a valid phone number okay so they are going to send an otp to my line so I think I have the whole tip in now so okay so my account is activated and my account is ready so what balance would you like to open first okay so you know I said you can have several accounts under the same account so if you want to start with an Australian dollar you can choose this British British pounds 
UAG, them, whichever of this. Okay, so all you have to do is just click on the account you want to create. Okay, then you have to pay a certain amount of money into the account to activate. I think you can start with twenty pounds. Okay. So for me to do this, I'll click on the open your G bp balance and it's going to bring out the bank account details where i'm supposed to pay the certain amount of money so once i pay in the certain amount of money my account is going to be activated so this is basically how it works i don't want to create an account again because i have an account already okay, so this is basically everything you need to do so once your account is up running and you want to add a business account to it okay so all you have to do is just let me quickly show you that Click on your profile button here and you see create a personal account or create a business profile. So when you're ready to create your business profile, all you have to do is just click on the create a business profile. So it's going to be asking details about your business, your country of business, your, your company type, the registered business name, the registration number, the business address, city and postal code. So once you have all these details, all you have to do is confirm it and in a few days later they're going to send a mail to you to confirm your business details okay so they ask you to upload your your business certificate and some other legal stuff about your business so this is basically i talk this is everything you need to know to create your personal transfer wise account i hope this video is helpful and if you like the video give it a thumbs up and don't forget i will add a sign up button at the description of the video so whenever you're ready to create your account just go to the description of the video and get started with the sign up link okay so thank you for watching i'll see you on the next one